woman of God. Who, who, do you know what pancreas is? What is a pancreas? This woman. I have problems with pancreas. Come, Come. Professor. Professor. Come. Come. Um, okay. I was told I needed surgery. Uh-huh. Professor. When I looked at you, the angel of the Lord pointed to you. Jesus. I praise you, Jesus. And I heard the angel of the Lord say, I'm going to fix her pancreas. Amen. But I don't know. You know I'm not a doctor. I don't, I don't know these things. This should tell you that there is somebody talking to me. I am not a doctor. Imagine you're looking at somebody random. You're telling them, woman of God, what is pancreas? Because I don't know what that is. Thank you, Jesus. Every time that I that I sit in bed and I try to read the Bible, the pain comes. And, you know, I prayed against it. And they said, you're going to need surgery right away. And I said, no, Lord. I know you can heal me. I know you will heal me. Thank you for this man of God. Thank you, Jesus, for this man of God. Thank you, God. Woman of God. Yes. I saw Elizabeth in a vision. Elizabeth, the mother of John. Are you listening to me? Yes, I am. Do you have sir. children? Yes. How many? I have one son. Bravo. Your son was a promised child. Yes. He came by miraculous means. Yeah. Because... Heaven is telling me about him. You didn't tell me about him. I'm telling you. He was a miraculous child. Yes, he was. Even his coming was miraculous. Yes, it was. Because in the realm of the spirit, there was some something inside of your stomach that was supposed to keep you and stop you from conceiving. <laughs> yes. Prophet. Yes. Prophet. Yes. That when the time of God to release this blessing came God overrode everything and when he was born at the age of two there was an attack against him that he should have perished as a child because there was a lot of complications when he even came it was almost premature because I'm seeing between the time he's supposed to come there was some battles Professor. Yes. It's true. Of course it's true. <laughs> Are you listening to me? Yes, I this am. This child was miraculous. Apostle. Extra miracle. This was the work of the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Yes, thank you, Jesus. Before you even had him, you dreamt that you are carrying a boy. <laughs> yes. Yes. Professor. Yes. A hundred percent. You dreamt you're carrying a boy. Yes. Everything you said is true. I was supposed to die with my son. And he had an attack. Yes. Yes. Everything you say is true. It's a hundred percent. This is for them, not for me. <laughs> yes. It's true. Now, now listen to me. How many sons do you have, sir? How many sons? Do you have sons? How many do you have? Professor! <laughs> we can do this all night. <laughs> Jesus, I praise you, Father. Lift your hands, sir. Lift your hands. You also have what? You have one son. One son. Professor, what I was asking you was a trick question. How many sons do you have? <laughs> hmm. Woman of God, where is your husband? He's at home. We need to pray for him. Yes. He needs healing. Yes, he does. Do you know that? Yes. You need healing. Yes. Not only of the heart restoration. There is something going on with his feet. Yes, he has gout. Huh? He has gout. What is gout? It's 
It's a uh, gout and shingles. It's like an infection and it's a rash in his legs. He takes pills for it. Yes. Prophesy. Prophesy. Can I ask you something, sir? Yes. Does your son have long hair? Yes. Prophesy. Prophesy. Is it like like this? Yes. Is it dropping like this? Yes. Prophesy. 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 Prophes